So one of our readers emailed in regards to our apartment development model asking how to solve for a given loan amount using this model. Now, what I mean by that, if we come into the sources and uses section, you'll note that construction debt is sized based on a loan to cost assumption. And so for instance, here it's set to 60%. If we were to change this to 65, what you'll find is nothing happens in the loan amount cell until we click this click to recalculate red button, right? As soon as we do that, what happens is in the background, a, ma a macro runs, it actually uses goal seek to, s to solve for a loan to cost that is equal to whatever input you have here in cell C57. But how does that, that goal seek work? Well, really, it's simple. Uh, if, you've, if you notice here, the equity amount is a hard-coded value. And what that gold seek uh, does is it changes the value of this cell until this cell, the percent of sources, is equal to this cell, the loan to cost assumption. So it's really quite simple. Now, you can manually make this change, right? So you can come into this cell I-56 and change this, say, to 22.5 of equity. And now that will automatically uh, adjust the loan amount because really uh, our sources are a, a combination of equity plus debt. The sum of that uh, being our total sources equals our total uses up here. So what about if we wanna solve for a specific loan amount? Well, again, it's quite simple. What we do is we're gonna run a goal seek. Now we can't use the red click to recalculate button to do this because uh, there's not a macro written for it. Instead, we just come, come up here to data select what if analysis, choose goal seek. And then uh, let's for instance say that uh, the lender is offering 34 million in proceeds. Uh, we set this cell, right? Our loan amount cell to 34 million by changing the equity cell, right? That that cell where there's hard, a hard-coded value. Hit enter and hit okay, and what's gonna happen is it's going to change that equity amount until the loan amount is equal to the 34 million. Now the last thing you, you'll need to do, notice this red click to recalculate button is there, and if you were to click that, it would now change uh, the loan amount until it was equal to the 65% of cost. So all we need to do is we, we need to ensure that this cell is equal to that cell. And to do that, we just simply grab this mount, uh, click control C, come over here, and we're just gonna paste this as values. This is That's really important. You don't wanna paste the formula. You're gonna paste this as values, which is right here, all right? Uh, or we can just do a alt HVV, and you'll see as soon as that cell equals this cell, the red click to recalculate button disappears. So that's how you can solve for a specific loan amount in our apartment development model. Let me know if you have any questions on this. Uh, otherwise, thank you for your time.